artifacts of Mars. And a teacher in Europe doesn't really say where he is, I don't think. If I find it in an article, I'll let you know. It looks like um, he's probably Dutch, but at any rate, his Muslim students were sitting there, whooping it up, cheering, and so forth, that about the bombings and people being killed, and this guy didn't like it. The teacher is on our side. His name's Ivar Mol. Uh, I'm not sure what that language is. I think it's Dutch, if there is such a language. I've seen I've seen that before, so I think uh, this is Dutch. But I I could be wrong. Anyway, remember Brussels teacher complaining about Muslim kids celebrating the attacks. Gets told by authorities not to complain. Can you believe this? After all those people were blown to bits by the practitioners of the religion of pieces, then his kids start celebrating it. And he tweeted out, hey, this is wrong. What's wrong with these kids? And the cops show up on his door and tell him, sorry, you can't do that, Buster. Can't say this. Police have time to visit this teacher despite being overwhelmed by the terror investigations. Within minutes of a bomb blast at Brussels' main airport, mobile phone and internet networks crashed after a second attack struck a metro station in Melbeek, which feeds the main European Union complex, Belgian soldiers who have a regular presence in the city since city center since last November's bloody attacks in Paris departed, apparently joining the first responders in both scenes. So this guy must be in Belgium. I don't know much about the languages there, other than I know a little German. At Center uh, Police Station, located in a few hundred meters from Grand Place, in the very center of Brussels, dozens of off-duty police, both in uniform and plain clothes, could be seen reporting for emergency duty, many carrying automatic weapons. A squad of Belgian Army Members known as paracommanders were also deployed and began patrolling various areas in the city center in full combat here. I'm going to boil this down. They don't want people to know that they don't want people to know that you know, Muslims are sitting here celebrating this. This doesn't fit in the narrative. We're expected to believe this has nothing to do with the religion of pieces. This is all peace, love, and joy, and these are just fanatics. That, uh, give me a break. These are just fanatics, and you can't separate two. I'm sorry. This religion has to get rid of. What do you call it? Uh, you have to get rid of all talk of jihad in the mosques. It has to be removed completely from the Quran. And women have to be women have to be treated better. They gotta start getting in line with the rest of the world. That's the bottom line. Well, the slaughter is gonna go on. So, there you have it, there, uh, you know, the authorities, no matter where you go, is, are basically trying to squelch expression of, free expression of speech, and unfortunately that's the way it is.
some artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching.